very bright. So, hi all you beautiful friends. Oh, the scent is just mm, so beautiful. So, this is a, a little short video uh, and it's sort of a little bit funny because I, 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 I mean, um, it's, it's about letting go of people and uh, I realized uh, with many of the videos I've made about letting go of people um, it's it's very much of course I'm speaking out of my own experience and the type of uh, person that I've been in my life um, so uh, yeah so, so a lot of times I've, I've been well the, the perspective has been that I had to let go of people uh, because I felt in a way they were pulling me down I just couldn't move forward very well so that's um, very much a theme in my life but um, there's also the other way around so that there's people that you're holding on to because you love them so much and you don't want to let them go because uh, it, you just feel it's so wrong and you can't live without them you feel you can't live without them so in a way you're clinging to them so I just thought I'd, I'd just shine a little light on this uh, because we all do it we all do both things we feel maybe feel somebody's clinging to us and we cling to someone else <laughs> and the whole as I see it this is just how I experience it uh, all clinging has to stop because it's a type of addiction when you're clinging to someone you can't let them go and <clears throat> the way to help ourselves stop clinging is to understand that these people have been representing something uh, for us that we have to find within ourselves so it might be a, a very warm person very loving person and what I feel we have to learn is to say okay because the person is, is trying to pull away from you and you can feel it and it's simply the universe telling you to let go just let go with love and start to understand that that whatever that person was giving you you have to find within yourself um, so all relationships as we move on and we awaken more and more uh, there will be no more addictions anymore we will be uplifting each other and inspiring each other and loving each other but we won't be clinging and holding on and another thing I think is really important to 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 remember and to tell ourselves is that these people who are trying to pull away they need to pull away from us because it's important for their process so if we, we if we love them we have to let them go and it might be uh, so dramatic that you're never going to see the person again in your life, in this lifetime. You will see them again when you return to heaven. We're all, we're all, gonna, we're all one, so we, we can't really be separate. But in some cases, a person leaves your life and you let go of them and you never see them again. And it might be one of your children. I know it for myself. I'm in that situation myself. I don't know if I'll be reunited with some of my children. I don't know. And I keep reminding myself if I really love them, to really, really show my love is to love them where they are and let go of them. If they need to be away from me, that's what they need. And loving them is not holding on to them. So true love is to let go. Uh, and there can be many, many, many things, many reasons why we're clinging to someone. It can also be someone that we actually. <laughs> who are not nice to us, who hit us. I mean, husbands or wives who hit their husbands, whatever. And peop they, they, they keep sticking together, they keep clinging together because they don't know anything else. They feel it's safe to be hit every day. <laughs> so they cling to them because they're so full of self-hatred, so it's natural for them to be treated bad. So it's all this inner healing. Uh, so but this video is especially about you who feel that you're actually clinging to someone they're trying to move away from you uh, I'm just encouraging you or just 
telling you how it can ease the process of letting go. To say that to yourself that this is important for your own growth to let them go and also to remind yourself that these people they need to be for a while without you, without the connection. So yeah, it's all, we're healing all these very unhealthy relationships and it's uh, not easy but we can do it. So and as you move on and you start to discover this beautiful whatever this person has been giving you, let's say it's something very wonderful, you will find it in yourself because God is within you. Everything you need is within you. And because in the situations where you you let go of one friend and you're so in so desperate and then you go and find someone else <laughs> who can fill up the hole. It doesn't work. It, it, they can't do it. They can't fill up that hole because it's uh, nobody in this world can fill you with love because it's your own love you have to find. So, yeah, I have an, a, a video I made a while ago actually about uh, how to connect more deeply with others. It's actually by connecting more deeply with ourselves. So the medicine for us is always to just really let go and go within and all will be given to us. So that was just a little thing. It's very hot here. So I'll finish the video. Take care. See you.